This is the Government British News, presenting the world to the world. Britain's battleships Anson and Howe put out to sea to engage in the biggest combined naval and air manoeuvres since 1939. From Invergordon Harbour, RAF Sunderland take the air on vital anti-submarine patrol. As soon as a sub is spotted, a sonar boy is thrown out to mark the position where the submarine has died. Also engaged in this tactical exercise is the 23,000 ton aircraft carrier Implacable. On her deck, emergency planes stand by ready for immediate takeoff. In this operation are a number of destroyers, including HMS Agincourt, seen coming alongside the Implacable. <laughs> Capital ships Superb, Anson and Howe steam majestically to their battle stations. Aboard the aircraft carrier, all is ready for a mock high-level attack from 20,000 feet. Planes take off to intercept the attacker. The implacable is straddled by several sticks of bombs and receives hits by rocket and torpedo. But naval aircraft are waiting to intercept and finally drive off the attack. Their work successfully done, the carrier planes make a return landing on the flight deck. Thus ends the exercise, ranging from the Orkneys across the North Sea to Stavanger in Norway, in a virtual rebirth of the Royal Navy. Thank you.